Oh yes. Mm -hmm. Now uh, we're just we're just starting uh, with the African continent. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now there's this absolute right of every human being, uh, the right of personal liberty. Yes. My sons have the right to uh, have me have custody of them. And they have the right to have you enforce the law. Mm -hmm. Now, um, there's numerous uh, enumerated rights that are embodied in writing. Yeah. I gave you what the Department of Justice says when I had explained to you the child abuse of my sons being in the wrong grades. <laughs> I didn't get a phone call. I still haven't. Yes. Now, uh, I explained the fraud of a picture of my sister Susan Bowers and how I had the right to sue Marilyn for her involvement in the fraud of using a picture of somebody that is not herself. Yeah. Now, uh, there's numerous rights, the inalienable right, a right that cannot be transferred or surrendered. Yes. Natural rights, such as the right to own property. The incorporated rights, a right that is stated to be part of the text of a legal document, especially a constitution. Yeah. We don't often think of the rights in the constitution as being incorporated. But let's say I looked at it as an actual legal document where the Bill of Rights has been incorporated so that governments could be sued for refusing to enforce it. It's kind of like a a contract between the citizen and the government? Yes. Where I say you violated all 10 of the Bill of Rights, all 10 of the amendments, some of them multiple times. <laughs> then there's the other 17 that were passed. One of them was repealed. And of those 16 available to me, you violated uh, 14 of them. Yeah. Some of them multiple times. 14th Amendment, the 13th Amendment, the enslavement of my sons because they've been trafficked. And I decide to sue the federal government because of the incorporated right of the legal document that happens to be called the Constitution of the United States of America. Now, each and every one of those nations in Africa that have constitutions, because I went through most of the nations of the world looking for the due process rights of the citizens of the individual nations throughout the, or throughout the world. And I found a lot of them have this, this right, the incorporated right in their individual constitutions that you cannot deprive any citizen of life, liberty, or property without due process of law. And when you don't give me notice of court hearings, you don't give me the actual documentation, you don't give me a dissolution of marriage, and you don't have any recipient. <laughs>